Hey, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to get the Ghost Editor in Trackmania Nations ESWC, or any other Trackmania game for that matter, I guess. But for this it's going to be in Trackmania Nations ESWC. Obviously you're going to need the game and Cheat Engine. I'll leave links for both those below, like a tutorial on how to get ESWC to run on Windows 10. Uh, so, run Cheat Engine, run Trackmania Nations ESWC, and in the description, or like in paste bin or something, I'm going to be putting a, a text file, like a, you know, it's going to have my documentation in my own words. So there's going to be like different words for stuff. So load challenge and load track are the same thing. Uh, it, I, I won't be changing that. <laughs> but you get the idea what it means. Uh, but for this, all you're going to need to know is the load editor value, or the load, uh, load track value, and the load replay value. So go in the game, select Nations ESWC, go to load track and search for 10, and then go back to the game, go to replay, and search for 5. And that should be the value. It's foolproof. You'll get it every time. But it changes every time you open the game. So go in, load a track. Uh, this is the crazy mode track I made. And change it to uh, 13. And lock the value by pressing the X here. Uh, leave the editor. And you should now be in the ghost editor. <laughs> It doesn't say it anywhere, it still says select challenge. Uh, I guess because there aren't any like graphics for the ghost editor. But it's there. Go into it. And since there's a crazy mode track, it'll be it'll start recording crazy mode ghosts. So record new ghost, save and quit, and quit without saving. And that's pretty much it. Uh, besides that, I'm gonna be leaving a download in the description. Uh, for base maps of unused game modes, such uh, for ESWC, Sunrise, and the original. Uh, ESWC being any game mode other than Race. And for Sunrise and the original, uh, it'll be Shortcut. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. Have a great day. <laughs>